This week at Hanahan High School, it is the 50th annual Hanahan Invitational Tournament. And to start it off, there was a home run derby this afternoon. Lots of local ball players competed, as well as some from Virginia, West Virginia, and even as far north as New York. It was a nice day out for a derby, and the start, the wind was blowing out, so that was good. But through the afternoon, it kind of shifted to a crosswind towards right field. So lefties had a real advantage if they could pull the ball down the line and get it high enough. Hanahan's field is 325 feet all the way around. The fences down the lines are just six feet, so another advantage to pulling the ball. The rest is 12 feet. So for the Derby, hitters had two minutes to hit as many home runs as possible. If there was a tie, there was a playoff for one minute. They hit off a pitching machine, so those are all the facts about it. And after the bracket came down to the final four, it was James Islands, Jackson Weatherford, AC Reynolds, Cooper Ingle, Berkeley's Jeffrey Ziegler, and Hanahan's very own Jonathan Barham. The final was a good one. It did not disappoint. Ziegler and Barham set to face off in the finals. And even fighting the wind, it was righty on righty. They each hit eight homers in this two minutes. So we went to a playoff. Barham went first and knocked three homers in the minute. But it was Ziegler. He hit, did this all day. He was just able to get that one more home run to go on and win the home run derby. I was just coming in you know, all season we've been the underdog at Berkeley so I mean I felt like the underdog going against a Carolina commit and then a Coker commit and then a Clemson commit and then another Coker commit so you I mean I just knew that if I won it was on me if I lost so what they're better obviously lefties had an advantage but I mean two righties in the finals so that was you know that was big um, I think the challenge is pacing yourself because I mean I'm, I'm like Jello right now I'm just absolutely fatigued gas nothing left in the tank it's Definitely the challenge is definitely having to pace yourself the whole time. It was tough.